like it or don't like it, sit down and look at it because it's the best going today. Woo! Welcome to G5 Jeff TV. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the share button as you come on in. Big shout out to the sponsors of the channel, my boy Fast Classic. This mixtape is in the description box. It is absolutely free. Definitely give him a download, give him a listen. And my boy Matt, definitely check his apparel out on IG at We All From. Now, I previously did a video on Avni Yildirim. For the people that don't know who Avni Yildirim is, he's the guy that fought Anthony Durrell for the vacant WBC title. And Anthony Durrell had that nasty cut and they had to stop the fight. And Anthony Durrell got a razor thin decision. And I actually thought Yildirim won that fight. And he thought so too because he uh, definitely disputed the decision. But he's fought Anthony Durrell before. He's fought Chris Eubank Jr. in the past. And he was made the mandatory for David Benavidez. Now, Vada came out with a drug test for Avni Yildirim and they said it was positive so me being G5 Jeff TV I came on the channel and I said Avni Yildirim was on, on the finest juices but I am a man of the people I'm a man of integrity and I like to put out factual information so with that being said the WBC has cleared Avni Yildirim of any wrongdoing in regards to this positive drug test now, the WBC's explanation was extremely detailed, and I'm going to take the time to read it for you guys. It says, the investigation and subsequent evaluation concluded that Mr. Yildirim did not ingest or became exposed to a banned substance knowledgeably or with a performance enhancement intention. Instead, Mr. Yildirim unintentionally and inadvertently became exposed to a substance as part of a muscular inflammation therapy he received in Germany, which was fully confirmed during the investigation. Credible evidence was presented that the source of the banned substance was a specific contaminated product that was administered to Mr. Yildirim. So that's the explanation. So very detailed. You don't get this after every positive drug test but i'm happy that the wbc and avni yildirim did what they were supposed to do in this situation to clear that man's name as much as i like to say a fighter's on, on the finest juices it's all in the spirit of keeping the uh sport safe and keeping the fighters safe anybody that's been listening to me you know uh the first rule of every fan should be for a fighter to be able to walk out of the ring and get home to his family so it's good that they cleared the situation up so now Avni Yildirim is the official mandatory challenger for David Benavidez and that's gonna be a damn good fight that's gonna be a damn good fight and I do give Avni Yildirim a shot in that fight y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section g5 jeff tv hit the subscribe button hit the like button please share this video support your boy support good content at all times i appreciate y'all peace